Alexios. Darius. I heard you coming, you know. I wasn't trying to sneak. Mm-hmm. It's good to see you. They've missed you? You know there is nowhere else I'd rather be. Adventure calls to people like us. For so long, my purpose was Persia. She was all I could see. But a parent's duty is not to their ambition. It's to their family, Alexios. <sighs> How's my boy? Oh, he's in terrible danger, Alexios. Elpidios is missing. What? <laughs> Oh, <laughs> they're playing hide-and-seek. Again? You know, it was Nima's favorite game, too, when she was Elpidios' age. How are they? We've been getting used to being in one place. It's harder than you think. Heard anything about the Order? Nothing, no news. After the Tempest, they've gone quiet. They're never quiet. Is Elpidios at the usual spot? <laughs> he loves that bitch. Make sure you find the boy. I always do. After you, Darius. Come, the beach is this way. You're still quite fast, Darius. Maybe you're just getting old. <laughs> Walls of flame. Skies. Black with arrows. More beasts and blades than Heracles himself. But not much parenthood. It's a different kind of battle. You'll do fine, Alexius. You are doing fine. Wherever could Elpidios be? Elpidios! Butter's coming to find you! A tent! We used to sleep in one and watch the stars together. That's where he must be. Elpidios loves splashing around in the water jars. I wonder... Is my little warrior... here? Hmm, guess not. Where's my baby? Huh? Where's my son? This shipwreck looks like it can hide Elpidios and this matter. Let me take a look. Aha! Found you! Wow! Isn't Pater a mighty Mystheos? He will surely tell tales of this epic adventure for years to come. Don't forget to pay the Mystheos for his heroic services. Ah, my usual rate. Welcome home. I've missed you, my love. Both of you. How's our littlest warrior? Been on more of your famous adventures, no doubt? A Cyclops? Oh, my. Oh, you slew how many Athenians? Impressive. You're putting Brasidas' record to shame. <laughs> oh, stop. How've you been? Safe. Feeling safe. Relaxed. Except our little warrior's appetite keeps growing. <laughs> Greedy boy. Darius sent me a note. Something about a celebration? We figured it was time for a little family gathering. And it's not a family gathering without a great feast. 
Elpidius and I will prepare the boar, won't we? Boar? That takes me back. Alexios and I will go look for some shellfish. We'll have the fire ready by the cliff. See you later, little warrior. Come, Alexios. It's been a while since we had some time to ourselves. Darius seems happier with Elpidios around. <laughs> Grandchildren have a mysterious effect on people. But I'm surprised you can go behind all that fear. What do you think Elpidios will be when he grows up? You mean It's not a bad life. I've got a boat. A ship, even. <laughs> He'll be whatever he wants. He'll be more. He'll be our son. This is a nice white spot. The pools are the perfect size for Elpidios. Been a while since I had shellfish. Spending time with you like this is... I like this. Me too, Alexios. Me too. So, do you think Elpidios looks more like me? Or like you? He's good looking, so... Me. Definitely me. <laughs> <laughs> You're probably right. These should do for our feast. You might have left some for everyone else. <laughs> Let's head back to the cliff before Father returns. There's something I wanted to show you. The cliff is this way. With Elpidios around, it's hard to get time together. He's a very demanding little boy. He gets that from his father. This view is just... Breathtaking. You said you had something to show me? <laughs> Maybe. Don't keep me waiting. We need to be quick about this. I haven't lost my touch, have I? It was great, but this isn't why I brought you here. Ah. I brought you here to show you this. This looks like a charm of some sort. My mother gave it to me when I was a child. This will keep you safe. May it see you through any storm. She was right. It brought you here. I'd wish I'd met her. But now, I don't need it anymore. Nima!
I can't promise I'll always be here, but I'll do my best. And I'll do mine. Here he comes. Here comes my big man. Elpidios is hungry. Well, he's had a big day out with his grandpa, Tordarius. Come on, Nima. Elpidios can stay up a little later. He needs his rest. He's had too much fun today. I should come with you. We'll be fine. Say bye-bye, Elpidios. <laughs> Close enough. <laughs> <laughs> the excitement of living on the road or do you enjoy the quiet life it's too quiet <laughs> uh -huh. I'm used to the growls of stalking wolves blades being unsheathed in the darkness Dime is just too quiet enjoying being a grand potter children are wonderful but to love so deeply is terrifying don't spoil him too much. Too late. This is it, Darius. A simple life. Elpidios! Hold on! Elpidios! Elpidios! Has anyone seen my son? Barnas, Alexios, welcome home. Morondas, you were with the Order? He is the Order, Amorgus. I trusted you, helped you. My friend, it's been far too long. We were protectors, Amorgus, champions of the people. This is wrong. This is necessary. I take no pleasure in this. I needed to draw you in. It's you I want, Alexios. You and your bloodline. Don't you dare touch her! Alexios, go! Get the fuck out of my way! Bring me your balls! Get it out! By the door! Help me! This is your last fight, too! It's burning! Oh! 
Go! Get Elpidios out of here. We leave together. No. I will make sure the Order can't catch up to you. There's too many. You don't have to do this. We have no time to argue. Go! Think about the child. I love you, Nima. Father. Come back to me. Keep them safe. Promise me. I promise. Pidios! Hold on! Get on the boat! Quickly! Morgus, did you see him? No. 
the beach. You promise to protect them. You promise to keep them safe. I should have stayed behind. I should have been with them. I... It's my fault. I did this. We're supposed to pay for our pasts, for our mistakes, not our children. There's no sign of Elpidios, but he's still alive, Darius. I know it. If the Order have him, we can find him. You've lost people you loved before. How... How did you survive? Who said I survived? They think they know pain, but I will teach them. They think they know hurt, but I will show them. They think they know fear, but I swear to you, Nima, I will bring them terror. I'll find our boy. I'll bring him home. Trust me. Alexios. By the gods. Oh, I am sorry. The Order did all this. This weaponry they brought would make even Ares turn his head. There's only one place in the Greek world that makes anything like it. Messenia. They came for us, for me. If the Order is in Messenia, that's where I'll go.
safe here. Let's not try to start a revolt while we're here. Hey, Koros! These kills were clean. And went inside. He stayed to stand watch. And then he just fell over. And there was... Did you see it? That safe? This looks familiar. It's just our imaginations, right? Someone's on the rampage. Darius! Eagle bearer. Never thought I'd find you here. Count yourself lucky. I didn't mistake you for one of them. What are you doing in Messenia? If Elpidios is alive, he's with Amorgus. And Messenia is Amorgus' stronghold. Looks like you figured that much out on your own. But it'll be hard to find him. He's too well insulated. I will tear this city down. Start kicking in doors. Kicking in heads. Nothing will stand between me and Arpidios. No. It has to be more precise than that. Amorgus won't be defeated that easily. Amorgus has the entire Spartan army at his back. Led by some of his most trusted commanders. It will be tough to get to him. Unless we weaken his forces. We can do that. The Order has a large production line for their weapons. There is a commander behind it all. Start by speaking to the Ilotes. They might know where he is. Also, the Cult of Cosmos is reinforcing the Order in Messenia. And an Order commander, Democratis, is in charge of seeing that through. If we cut him down, the Cult will no longer be in our way. I'm good at calling the cult. And there's one more thing. I've heard that the Order has captured an Athenian general. He is integral to my plans. You will need to free him and give him this letter. And then I get Elpidios. Tell me more about Democratis. Amorgus put him in charge of the Order's dealings with the cult. He's well known, but he seldom makes public appearances. This is a rare opportunity to get to him. This Athenian general. What do you want with him? If we free him, we will have a powerful ally. Where can I find the Ilotes for information on the commander? In Epia. That's where all the weapon manufacturing happens. I'll get it done. We'll strike them hard and fast. We? Oui. It will be faster and more efficient if there's two of us. Getting Elpidios back is my top priority. I'll tolerate you until then. Good. The feeling is mutual. I've wasted enough time here. Come back when you finish disrupting the order. There's more to be done.
Have you seen the Ilot named Drodi? Yes, she was taken to the center of Epia. I have heard she's going to meet her end there. Count Center. I should hurry. What you get for taking what isn't yours. Your death shall be a warning to them all. I don't care who the food belongs to. We were hungry. If you're here for the show, I think you'll have a clearer view from down there with the rest. Who are you? I'm angry. I'm impatient. And I'm out of time. So, I'm not here to talk. What do you mean? You want to kill this woman too? <laughs> I'm not in the mood for mercy, so I suggest whoever wants to keep their limbs, leave now. Fine. Cowards, leave your honor at the door and run with your tails between your legs. As for the brave, get the Mystios! Yours when they get what you came for,
That was close. Thanks, Miss Theos. Good thing you came along. Bye. Wait. I'm looking for the commander. I was told you know something about him. The commander? Oh, I know him all right. <laughs> Brings back fond memories. I used to work for that Malakas. This commander sounds terrible. He's ruthless, Miss Theos. He would work us till our hands were red and raw, and we'd bleed and cry until dawn. Even the children weren't spared. Which is why I have to pinch food when I can. It's never enough. You were lucky I arrived just in time. How did you get caught? They caught me stealing one loaf of bread and sentenced me to death. So what if I stole from them ten other times? It's too much! Too severe! Point me to the commander, and I'll stick my blade through his throat. You're looking to kill him? Mm-hmm. Great. Things are happening in Messimia, Mistios. Look at how we're suffering, how the children suffer. There must be something better out there for them. I have a plan to get the children away from here. My son and the others. Help the children, and I'll help you. I'll help, but it'll cost you. What? You would ask for Drachmi in a time of crisis such as this? Amistios has to eat too. Fine. I'll give you whatever I have. <laughs> Mostly breadcrumbs. What's your plan to get the children out? We have a fisherman nearby who is being paid handsomely for the job. We need to take the children to his boat near the docks, but we need to leave soon. Time is almost up. Lead the way. Follow me. Hello, my little pebble. No time to talk. We need to go. Now. Who's this? A mysterious friend. He's going to help us get out of here. All right, everyone. Matter says to follow the mysterious. Stay in the group Hurry! so we don't get lost. Stay in a group so we don't get lost. <laughs> this is serious. Do you have a hero name, mysterious? A hero name is a cold name only the greatest, bestest heroes have. It is usually a combination of a cool animal and the weather. Tell him your hero names, children. <laughs> Mine's Wolf Storm. Mine's Sark Lightning. Roar. Mine's... Uh, He's uh, Chicken Rain. I knew I would find you here, Eagle Bearer. You caught me. You were right. You're always at the center of the chaos. Now, why don't you step aside and let me do my job? I'll deal with you. And you after I take the children away. They have work to do. Why wait? I've been looking for you. Thanks for sparing me the effort. I can deal with you now. Let's not waste any time, then. I'll make an example out of your screams. Why don't you choose one for me?
it. You don't Eagle need to Thunder, do that. Eagle Thunder, Eagle Thunder, Eagle Thunder. That was super amazing. Mistyos, you did it. It's time for you to go, little pebble. You're not coming? I can't. I have to stay here and work hard so I can visit you one day. No! No! Where's my mother? Where's my mother? <laughs> I can't be without you, mother. Who will hug me when I have a bad dream? Mistyos, I... I'm not sure. Now that we're here, I don't know if I can bear to send them away. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make us go, please! Children shouldn't be separated from their parents. You should stay. I get to stay? Mater! We'll be together! Mater! Mater! I'm happy my pebble is staying. But is it the right choice? It would be cruel to tear these families apart. It might be even more cruel to subject them to a life in Messenia. I don't know if I'll be able to protect them. We will always fight for our children. Always. And you got your commander. Thank you, Mistyos. May our paths cross again. Athenian Darius was talking about. What do I call you? Most people call me Eagle Bearer. The what? You heard me. It just... I've heard the stories we all have, but I never thought... I don't have time for stories. Right, right. It's these Malaka Spartans. We desperately need to loosen their grip on this region. Will you help us? At the moment, I'm not a big fan of the Spartans. Or their friends. The Persians. You know. I know those Kert Spartans are richer than I've ever been, and should have run out of resources years ago. I was told to give you this. Uh huh. It seems we have common enemies. I can help you and your allies with your plan, but to do it, we must kill the Spartan leader here in Messenia. 
What's so special about this particular Spartan? He's a butcher. He's killed more Athenians than anyone, and he takes joy in it, I tell you. We know his location, but my men and I haven't been able to get close to him. You'll find it easier with me around. There. That's his fleet. Oh, his fleet, you say?
that's all. That Spartan dog is just a memory now. You did it? The Spartan butcher was no match for me. Of course. So, about the letter you gave me? I'll need you to live up to your end of the bargain if you want the Persians out of Messenia. Uh, you can count on our help when you are ready. That's the meeting place. What do you know about this man in Amorgis' inner circle? Democratis. Drachmi is his weapon of choice. If we kill him, the Order's ability to influence the Greek world will be severely damaged. His death will bring us one step closer to Amorgis. To Elpidios. I like Drachmi, but it can't buy the kind of edge my blades provide. Not when I'm driven to find my son. There's only one problem regarding Democratis. What's that? I don't know what he looks like. Then we'll have to listen closely when we approach. If anything goes wrong, remember it's Democratis we're after. The order has arrived. You're late. We arrived precisely when we meant to. Remember, once Democrati shows himself, we kill him. Or we can kill everyone. I'm assuming you brought... Yes. Don't want to be caught here. Yeah. About that, we're not sure we're giving you any more. <laughs> to be pinned and mounted by this Mystios and his pet bird. Consider this your final chance to do your duty and back us up to Messenia. You clearly don't know the Eagle Bearer. And who are you to throw away our alliance? As far back as Xerxes, we've been working together towards peace. Peace? Don't lecture me about peace. You're the ones who plunged the Greek world into endless conflict for your own benefit. You think we don't know? <laughs> Amorges was right. How far the cult of Cosmos has fallen. The value we've given to this alliance I'll never understand. I should kill you where you stand. Think very carefully about what you're about to do. God strike you down, you Gratis. God strike you down. You just keep paying, and we'll keep our end of the deal. This meeting is over. So we continue the arrangement? Democratis! That's him. That's Democratis. Just one conversation, and I'll not only discover what's most important to someone, but how to destroy it. Fuck! 
Mort will save him from me. Yeah. Mal got him. Gratis is dead. One step closer to Elpidios. I've got to return to Darius. Democrates is dead. They deserve to die for what they've done, Darius. Every last one of them. Alexios. They're between Elpidios and me. The Order works to bring order. I clean the mess that follows. Give my regards to Hades. Everything has a place and a proper order. It is a universal principle none can violate. The watch will be vigilant here. Things that we think define us are the lies that enslave us. Off we go now. There will be trouble if I'm spotted. <laughs> We've weakened the order. Now what? Now we move on to the next part of the plan. 
We'll take the order down under the cover of night. I have an Athenian general to speak with. I'll return to the lumber yard to prepare our next steps. Bevel, it's not safe here. I was asked to pass this to you, Eagle Thunder, by a man in a mask. Bevel, you have to go. And don't speak to any more masked men, understand? It's not safe. Yeah, yes, Eagle Thunder. Man with a mask. Meet me at the graves in Epia. What is the order up to? Doubt can destroy the greatest confidence, and we all have doubts. Eagle-bearer, well met. I see you got my note. Hmm, I'm surprised I'm still alive. That could change. Hasty. No need to be hasty, Eagle-bearer. Let me introduce myself. My name is Yeryis, the last Magi of the Order. I've been eager to meet you, Alexios. May I call you as such? Only my friends call me Alexios. We may become friends yet, who's to say? Give me one good reason not to put my blade through your throat! Where is Amorgis? Where is my son? I have the answers you seek, Alexios. I know what happened in Ahea, in the village called Vime. Vime? What do you know? Tell me! I was there. Things are never what they seem. Your reality is limited to what you perceive. Ride with me. I've been wanting to speak to you. I'll show you how beautiful our world can be. Shall we? One wrong move. I understand. This way. Where are you taking me? Somewhere nice. I want to learn more about you. I don't trust you. I followed your journey from the beginning. I've written quite a bit about you, actually. In fact, some of my most popular work is about the Eagle Bearer. In addition, I've heard of your tales from our friends. The cult? I didn't think the cult made friends. <laughs> Allies then, if you prefer. Come on. written many Ella. stories scattered across the Greek world. I spread the word of our doings, of our heroic deeds. Heroic? You call murdering innocents and burning villages heroic? Narrow. The Order sees things from a broader perspective. We do not seek ephemeral peace. Our work is eternal. Malaka! around us. Such promise. You must be wondering why we hunt you. I've killed enough of you to have an idea. Oh, you're a force of nature, Alexios. Have you noticed? Danger is drawn to you like vultures to a battlefield. So we simply cannot allow you to exist. You kill someone because of their blood? You disgust me. We are not the enemy. Have you considered yourself? In our eyes, you are the manifestation of turmoil, the disruptor of peace. Don't be so quick to judge, Alexios. There are many perspectives. Oh, 
Come on! You've arrived. Oh, look at that view. Messinia. Quite a beauty, isn't she? Get to the point. I know what happened in Dima. How Nima died. Are you brave enough to hear the truth? I want to know everything. We saw no one at the beach that day. No Nima, no child. They had escaped. Or oh, so we thought. Until we heard a cry. It was coming from a ship, wrecked on the shore. The soft, but unmistakable cry of a child. Herpidios. There was nowhere to run. <gasps> Nima tried to resist, but it was futile. The baby was all that remained. I will find a Morgis! I'm sure he would expect you to try. What do you want from me? Our stories are written by a rare few who have the power to shape them. It's not every day I can speak to someone like you. There are no absolutes, Alexios. Not even with tainted ones. You are fireborn with the potential to destroy, but also to warm, to cast a light in the dark. The warmth you try to destroy! <laughs> People die, Alexios. Eventually we'll all be forgotten, fading away like a distant dream. Our actions, however, if they're meaningful, will be remembered. Tell me, what do you want to be remembered for? I want to be remembered as a Mystios, who knows no mercy, and strikes fear into their enemies' hearts. Hmm, insights. Such wonderful insights. Thank you. And now we must part. The question is, will you allow me to live with my life? I can't let you live. Not now. Not ever. We are what we choose. I will live and die by my choices. Know this. You cannot stop the Order. Even in our deaths, we live on. We are everywhere, now and in the future. It was a pleasure to meet you, Alexios. We meet again, Eaglebearer. Good, you're back. Now to set our plan in motion. We will set several fires. The smoke will force the Ilotes to flee and draw Amorgus' guards down from the mine. Striking at the heart of the enemy while minimizing the cost of innocent lives. A wise plan. I will see to it that my men light up the rest of the area. What happened? Nima died, protecting Elpidios. Someone from the Order wanted to meet with me. He was there, Darius. They found Nima in the shipwreck. She tried to fight them all. This 
was Nima's. I haven't had a chance to. I forgot I even took it. She's gone. She's really gone. And she's never coming back. I'll never forget her, Darius. I miss her. Even now. I miss her so much. We'll have time to grieve when this is over. Right now, we know Elpidios is alive. It's time to get him back. If Amorgus is here, Elpidios must be as well. Once we start, we can't go back. They will come at us with all they've got. It's time to attack. The price may be... everything. I know the price. to find the boy. It is.
Where is Amorgis? The mines! But you'll never get around his defenses! I'll crush his defenses, and then I'll kill him! You're insane! Both of you! You're going to tell Amorgis that the Eagle Bearer, the great disruption of the Greek world, is here at his door! You tell him I'm coming for him! For Elpidios! And I don't knock! Go! I'll take care of the order guards. Get to the mines. I'll take out as many as I can on the way. You must be here somewhere. From me, Amorgis. It's too quiet. Stop hiding, Amorgis. Come get what you deserve. Look, the eagle bearer. Yes. He's in the temple above the mines. But that time will come. He's just like Yeris described in his entries. Fierce. Oh, Yeris. He was the best of us. You were his favorite character, Eagle Bearer. And yet, you murdered him. Yeris was part of the Order. All of you deserve what's coming. We have no intention of walking away. I'll get to my son. <laughs> Elpidios. He still has his littlest warrior in his heart. He still has... hope. <laughs> <laughs> what a foolish thing to hold on to. <laughs> <laughs> We will fight for Persia until our dying breath. The lives, the raised cities. It is for Amurge's vision of peace, his grand design. All things are permitted. I'll find you. 
Morgus, today you bleed. For every soul that lives in peace, others had to die. It's the only way. Come on, come on. Perpidios, I'm almost there. My son, Pater's coming. Aren't they? Moments like these. The moments before the end. If you've hurt my son, nothing will protect you. No man, no beast, no god. He's safe with me, Alexios. Happy, healthy. And I promise you, he always will be. Think about where we're going, Amorges. This path can only end in one place. Unless you tell me where to find my son. I'm sorry, Alexios. I can't do that. I once swore to the people I love that I would crush the Order. Believe me, I will keep that promise. You think you can destroy us? <laughs> The Order's plan goes well beyond you, Alexios. What? Ever the hero, thinking this is all about you. This isn't about any one of us. It's about that most precious of things, peace. This war between Athens and Sparta threatens to incinerate more than just the Greek world. The carnage and butchery have spread to Persia and beyond. The Order has the power to save the world. And so we will. My agents are rooted deeply in every aspect of Greek life. We have seeped into your establishments, your temples, your homes. We are winning the hearts of your people. Through the Order's influence and Persia's wealth, Sparta will end this war. A new chapter in history will be written... by us. We have planted a seed in the fertile soil that is the Greek people. And now, peace will grow. Only one threat to that peace remains. You. You want a war, you monster? I'll give you a war. You already have. You're a tainted one. The strongest, most dangerous force the Order has ever seen. You are fire. Only you stand in the way of the Order's purpose. You've forgotten our promise, old friend. Artabanus, I wondered when you'd make your dramatic entrance. Think of the innocent lives that were lost, Amorgus. You claim to want peace, but what good is peace when it's enforced by tyranny? I fought for the greater good, for our children, for their futures. I saved your grandson, and I saved Artaxerxes that night. Do you remember? I saved him from you. Tell us where Elpidios is. I'm sorry. As long as I breathe, I will never endanger the child by letting him raise him. <laughs> Be safe. He's my son! 
Sun rises, but she also sets. My time is over, old friend. We were protectors, Amorgus. We were champions of Persia, of the people. I still am our Hvanos. I only wanted to keep our home safe, the world safe. The child of Morgus, please. He's on a small island just off the coast of Messenia. Perfect spot for fishing. The Order will never give up, Alexios. You and your boy will always be hunted. And he will always have me to protect him. The Order aren't just a group of people. They're an idea. An idea cannot be beaten. An idea cannot be destroyed. Not by blades, but through knowledge through wisdom, through ideas of our own. Nothing is absolute, Amorgus. You taught me that a long time ago. There will always be tyrants. And there will always be you, my brother, to stop them.
Morgus was true to his word, Albidios will be there. Others coming. If I get overturned out here, I don't think... Just a moment more, Albidios. over my son every day every night Amorgis made sure of it thank you you know he has a real Spartan appetite <laughs> tell me about it Butter's got so many stories to tell you. <laughs> and you've got some stories for Butter too, I see. Who are you? I am Darius. Son of the Persian king, Artaxerxes. Artaxerxes. You know my father. We've met, but it's been a while. He's a good king and a great father. Persia knows peace. She prospers. I miss him. Keep Persia safe. That is his legacy. Time. Just a moment longer. It has to be now. What will you do? Morgus was right. I am fire. I'll use that. A beacon to the Order. If they want to come after my bloodline, they'll know exactly where to find me. But they'll never find... And, uh, what will you do, Darius? The Order was created for a purpose. If I can understand our enemy, I can outmaneuver them. I will protect the boy, Alexios. Be a guardian to Elpidios and to all those who share his blood. When the day comes, when he asks of his pater, <sighs> what should I tell him? Tell him he had a pater, and a mater who lived incredible lives, who saw incredible things, and none of it was as incredible as him. 
His smile, his laugh, the sight of him asleep in my arms. Should a day come where he feels unloved or alone, you tell him there is no such day because he will always be loved. You hear me? You will always be loved. You'll fight, and you'll fall. There will be times when you'll think you can't rise again. You'll want to stay down, but you will get up, Elpidios. Because you're strong. Because our bloodline is strong. And because we always get up. You'll ask why. And while you'll never know me, know this. You are my son, and I will always fight for you. You, and those that will come after. The Morgus is dealt with, and I have his blade. It's useless, broken, and the metal is strange. I should find a blacksmith. Our baby's safe. Your father, too. It's only you I could... I never got the chance to say goodbye. There are some things I want to get for you. This time, I'll be back. This is it. We used to love this place. Now... Where I need to be. There you <laughs> this was the beginning, Nima. How could we have known?
Here is your bow, where you left it. You'll want it back. What am I thinking? This boat can't go out this far. This looks like the place. Her baby's blanket. What a relief it was to find him. Now he's gone away as well. Now everything's done. I should visit Nima's grave in Achea. It's time to say goodbye. These are ours, a reminder of our time together. I miss you, your laugh and your infuriating insight. <laughs> I'll never forget you, Nima. Trust me.